I'm kidding. So like Shane, chapter two, you crash me. <clears throat> Dang it, Kath. You didn't have to pull me into this. I forgot to walk. Oh my god, bro. Okay. Hey, exam results are out. Can't wait to see which ones I flopped. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. You know what? That's kind of bad. You know what? That, that's 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 kind of bad. Chemistry. Oof, bro. Wait, do I got to click on them? Oh, I do. Oh, that's Luis. Wishful thinking. That's me, isn't it? Oh my god. Wait. I'm not flopping this one. When pigs fly, Mark. When pigs fly. Okay, nice. But which did I flop this time? Okay, I'm a gamble. This one. Oh, how dare I under underestimate my intelligence. This one. Almost there. This one. Huh? Seems too good to be true. This one. Don't peek at the names. Keep guessing. It's over 30. Um, 40. Come on. Whoa. Is this really mine? Oh, cool, but... Where's the one that's below 30? Oh, no. Ah, there it is. Of course, couldn't go without a flunky... Flunk-worthy score. Guess I better make up to Mrs. Flores. Yeah, not bad. Ah, that, that's just a fluke. Wait, what was that? Oh. Oh, the piano. <sighs> Sorry. I'm gonna fall asleep. Oh. Wrong. <laughs> my god. Oh, is that his mom? Oh my god. The notes are lost in this hazy memory. I have to rearrange them. No, that's not how I remember it. Try to remember, please. Honestly, piano has got to be my favorite instrument. She's such a lovely, talented kid. Do you like it? Focus. Concentrate. Damn. What the hell? Going all in on this piano thing, huh? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not doing that voice. <laughs> Though, you might want to tone it down. If you don't want to look like a possessed idiot. You didn't have to do that. 
God, you nearly gave me a heart attack. Poor guy. Just you wait, Gath. I'm telling you. Just look at those sunken eyes. You're absolutely... You absolutely needed that energy surge. And whose <laughs> fault do you think that is? Well, well. Don't you accuse me of your own wrongdoing. I told you we'd go early today and still. You chose to sleep late over some lame ass MMO. But who's the one responsible for dragging me into this stupid plan? Huh, right. I wonder who. Don't you. Hey look. Still haven't answered my question. The results are out. <sighs> hmm, let's see. Just get enough sleep next time, please. God knows what other creepy shit you'd be doing alone. <sighs> I was... Forget it. Anyone will be here any moment now. Then they'll be like, Whoa, Mark. Is that you? This early? Oh. Looks like you need another scare to wake you up. I got a 13 on art. The third skill would just be overkill. Oh my god, I can't fucking read. A third scare would just be overkill. Hmm, are you sure? I'm wide awake now. Don't you... Uh, worry. If you say so. Oh, burp, damn. What you got there? Well... Oh my god! What the heck? It's decent. Nothing surprising. Your definition of decent is what's surprising here. Well, unlike you, my bar's higher. To be fair, my bar's higher than yours. Mine's just upside down. Well, I guess they... I can live with this. What? Live with... Are you... Oh, I get it. We're playing the humble game. Aren't we? Huh? Well, Kath, look at these. What do you think of my disgraceful scores? Uh, let me guess. The usual 30, 34s, barely passing. Maybe you got lucky this time I got a 36. I said, look at my scores. Fine. What? 30? 30 what? Uh-huh. You saw that, right? Humbly, I did get a 36. What have you done? Were you sitting next to Luis? Did you just cheat? I'd never commit such a crime. I'd unfortunately finally tried my hand at actual, actual study. H how did you study? When? I don't mean to brag, but it took just two good hours of studying without distraction. All just a day before the exams. No biggie. Shit, man. Remember what I told you last time? About that sleeping genius in my noggin? Yeah. And just like that, like a phoenix rising from the ashes, it has awakened from its eternal slumber. Ah, uh, that's it. Playtime's over. This is a fluke. Teachers were forgiving. Exams were just too easy. No, they weren't. Period. Period. Hell no. I'd argue it wasn't all easy at all. Oh, really? Yeah. It was... Oh, shit. Where are you? Speaking of flukes, this stupid plan actually worked. Shh. 
Not yet. <laughs> Lie low. Keep it down. Remember, we have to establish a strong connection with the target. At the soonest. You weren't kidding. New students do come in early. Newbies like her would want it to attract attention. So they can mingle as much as they can before classes start. And do you really think that... Being her first new friend is worth sleeping early for? That's correct. You get a higher chances of winning her heart. I read that online, by the way. So why the heck did I get dragged into this if it's just about you? Duh. Because you're the backup plan. Wait, what? That wasn't part of the plan. Shh, quiet. Now what? So much for they want to attract attention and mingle. Trust me. She might be a meek one. I've seen this kind before. Quiet as a mouse. But once you get to know her, well, you'd be surprised. We'll see about that. Oh my, she's pretty. Did you see that? Yeah. And I can also see where this is headed. I know, right? We'll get together and become good friends. Then I'll ask her on a date. Then we'll watch the stars. Then do whatever they do in movies. I hate to break it to you, but... This isn't Hollywood. It's now or never, man. Here I go. Great. Hey there. Kate, right? Off to a great start. Uh, I'm Catherine Joyce. But you can just call me Kath. I'm the friendliest one you'll ever meet here. As you can probably tell. Your name's Kate, right? Kind of sounds like mine, you know? What a coincidence. I'm sure that means we'll be good friends. Ah, yes. I, I know that feeling, my friend. Sucks transferring to a new school, I know. Y you'll get used to it, for sure. We're all nice around here. Especially me. No wonder you haven't had a girlfriend yet. But then, I'm one to talk. So, uh, welcome to Liamson Integrated School. This is Class 9 Pearl. Kath at your service. Uh, you must be the silent type, huh? I'm the polar opposite of the silent type if you keep talking. <laughs> so it would be very nice of you. If you keep that mouth shut. Thank you. I, but I... I said thank you, didn't I? <laughs> so? Welcome to Hollywood, eh? What's the problem? Cat got your tongue? Or should I say... Kate got your tongue? You dickhead! That shitty joke did not help at all. I've been stripped of all my dignity. Didn't you see? I did. And it was fun. Well, let's see who's laughing now. What the hell are you doing? I told you. You're the backup plan. Who said anything about that? Just face it. Now go ahead and talk to her. Oh no. Not like I have any dignity to lose anyways. Uh, Sorry for the commotion back there. That was just my friend who's uh too friendly. She's just like that sometimes. <laughs> Look, I don't want to meddle in your affairs. But... I just want to welcome you. This place sucks, but... 
it's got its moments. As expected, I'm talking to a wall. This is pointless. I'm out. Wait. Go ahead. You're free to make a comeback. Did someone tell you? Uh, tell me what- Oh, your zipper. Isn't it? About the... The? Never mind. Uh... Wanna talk about it? No. You may leave now. But we just talked. Kind of. I'm not fond of all this yapping. Okay. Name's Kate. If that helps, shut your mouth. Uh, I'm Mark. Nice to meet you. I guess. And that's our new classmate, folks. Hooray! I'm gonna have to do that voice for a long time, am aren't I? Man, I don't know what just happened back there. But, but, that ain't fair. I'm the social butterfly here. Not you. I'd think twice about that title if I were you. But, but... But just how? She even introduced herself. If you could even call it that. <sighs> now that's... Now that this mission has failed, would you please let me take a nap? Whoa, Mark! Is that you? This early? Put a sock in it, Ryan. Hey, dude, that must be... Katrina, right? What's up, Katrina? Whoa, you too, Kath? Dude, why'd you guys come in so early? Kath? Hello? Yo? Kath got your tongue. Yo, shut up! Wake up, sleepyhead. It's lunchtime. Don't you want to play our, our air piano again? <sighs> me, 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 me. Uh, oh, <laughs> shit, that noise, bro. <clears throat> mm, finally. Rise and shine. So how much sleep did you get? One measly hour? Make it two. It's a good thing you got lucky today, Junjun. What? You slept through three classes in a row. You know, just like Junjun over there. The motherfucker's still sleeping. I did what? <laughs> Why didn't anyone wake me up? Well... We tried, but it was no use. Oh my god. You were in a deep sleep. And we couldn't get the sleeping beauty up. Oh my... No one wanted to kiss you. You almost fucking dunked a book over my head. So yeah. What did the teacher say? They didn't want to kiss you either. I'm sorry. Am I kissing my grades goodbye? That's where you got lucky, man. They didn't give a damn. At least for now. What a relief. I swear, just one more warning for Mrs. Al Mr. Alfonso. And I'm out of here. He was surprisingly in a good mood. He was in a good mood. He was in a... Jesus, I can't read, bruh. They say he got back with his ex-girlfriend. Good for him. What about Mrs. Flores? What are you talking about? Arts after lunch break. Hey, speaking of... What did you paint? Mm, uh, 
Paint what? You know, for a poster project. Oh no, bro. Oh, not again, bro. Oh no. He did it again. He fumbled again. Shit. I know. It's so cliche. But man, I did it all on my own. And I'm so proud of it. What do you think? Uh, I think... I think I'm in trouble. There's no way. Cramming this is flat out impossible. I have to or I'm getting kicked out for real. So I say... How many minutes do I have left? <coughs> Seven minutes. Are you crazy? I've always been. I know you cram. But this is just insanity. Hey! hey! I was fast, bro. I was gone. Oh my god. Yes, we have the music. Just gotta dash, in my, way to the, dash my way to the supply store. I can do this. Run! Oh my god, swerve! Oh fuck. Ow, I hate life. <laughs> you know it. <gasps> oh shit. Uh, shit, I'm sorry guys. Hey, come back here at once. I couldn't fucking decide, bro. I'm going to bait something so avant garde and pretentious. It'll knock Flores' socks off. I'm so sorry, guys. I did not mean it. I couldn't decide. Speed up. What the hell, bro? Excuse me, just dashing through. Ah, I got it. I'll just splash paint around. And just like that, I'm the next Pollock. I can't decide on these fucking... Oh fuck, dodge right! Oh shit! Damn! Our precious streets! Not even Christmas yet, run! Sorry, my bad. Target locked, baby. We're almost there. I'm gonna trip and fall, aren't I? Uh oh. What are you doing out here? Oh no. Leap! Oh shit! Out of all the numbers, nah. Out of all the numbers from zero to fifty, I got a score of thirteen. Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Uh, ouch! Uh, could this day get any worse? Hey, Mark. Uh, hey. Billy, my guy. What's up? What's the last minute rush today? Need anything? Marker, pen, printing? Xerox? I did need something, but I don't think... I don't think I'm in a good shape to cram right now. That girl is in good shape as well, it seems. Oh my god! Uh-oh. I'm cooked. Ah! You! You monster! I don't need your hand. I have two and I can stand on my own, okay? Hey, I... Uh, what? What's your deal? Sorry, but I didn't mean to. Didn't mean to ru ruin someone's first day in this school. Okay, sure. 
Thanks, I guess. To be fair, you were blocking the halls right in the middle. Wow. So are we just gonna totally ignore the fact that someone was ruthlessly bar barreling through these halls? I know. But sorry, you're in the wrong too. I lost my consciousness for a moment there. You almost killed me for Pete's sake. Hey, I'm... Look at this mess. Look at me. I'm a mess. This is... I was so excited to... To start a brand new life here. <laughs> that dragon ball thing. You're just gonna... Gonna mess it up like that? What am I supposed to do? Whatever. I never want to see your face again. Great. Both of you! Principal's office, now! <laughs> oh no! Fortunately, we have extra uniforms for students. You ought to return them next week. You understand? Do you two realize the consequences of your misbehavior? Let this day teach you a well-deserved lesson. Scary. You will stay here until dismissal. I've called the principal. She'll be here in a few hours. Wait a second. Have I seen your face before? Uh, me? Yes? Why, I have no idea what you mean, Miss Lekaspi. I knew it. Just how many warnings do I do you have left before you get expelled? I don't know. I'm invincible? <laughs> hey, uh... Yeah, I gotta put some... No spray in because my nose is starting to close up. There we go. No spray. Okay. Candy, do you want one? I cannot speak when my close my my nose is closed. Mint? Fruit? What was I thinking? Candy won't be enough to tame the beast. There's gotta be something here. Let's give her a taste of this fancy smash smanchy coffee. Fancy schmanchy. Goddamn. That'll lift her spirits up. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. What can I get for you? You know, they've got a coffee maker with a grinder here. Top of the line gear. They've got Arabic beans too or whatever. Cream or of the crop. You won't find this anywhere else. It's Arabica you jerk. Hey! Now we're talking. So you want a cup of Arabica? This is the best coffee you'll ever have. I promise. My hipster friend would kill for this. I'll take that as a yes. Smells so good, doesn't it? Nearly done. I know you can't wait. One cup for you. And one cup for me. Mm-hmm. Ah, it never disappoints. <laughs> don't let that specialty go to waste. You don't always get a chance to taste overpriced tuition. That's where it all goes. Come on, before it gets cold. Maybe she'd rather have iced coffee. Oh, she really doesn't want to look at me, huh? I get it. <sighs> Whoa, this one's new. I haven't seen these before. 
Would you look at this bad boy? Whoa. Hey, look. It's not severing my arm. It's just an amazing what overpriced tuition can buy. Apparently, bladeless fans are un unexciting. Fuck. Oh my god. It all went down here for a hill from here. Watch this. Useless but fun fact. Our lavish principal has three cars. A pickup. A sedan. And an SUV. What you just heard was the SUV. I love it. It has the best beep. <laughs> Not interesting enough for her. Who know John? I wouldn't be surprised if Jun Jun takes a gold medal home too. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Greetings, my fellow L Liam Sonians. I just want to announce that you can never get rid of me. I keep this school running with my pockets as deep as more. Rihanna's. <laughs> no matter how many times you detain, warn, or punish me, you won't ever have the balls to let me go. I may not be a genius or a dreamer, but I've got uh, epic bangs. That's all for my beloved school. Thank you for your attention. Too bad security cams don't record audio. What an audience! I'd, I'd at least appreciate a round of applause here. <laughs> I've tried everything now. Forget it. This is useless. Do I leave? Give up? No, I don't give up. The heck? Is there a way to not give up? I don't want to give up yet. Okay, I guess there's no other way to give up. Man. Crap, I don't wanna I don't wanna give up. It's too easy. But sure, I guess we got it. I give up. I did all I could possibly do. Nothing could make you speak. Besides stupid Arabic beans. Two nine nine five, two point nine nine six, two point nine nine seven, two point nine nine eight, two point nine nine nine, three thousand. Oh my God! I counted the three thousand, but my dumb ass said two point. God damn! I'm stupid. Oh wow! Would you look at the time? It appears we have three more exciting hours left. Imprisoned here with nothing to do. Except, you know, socialize like humans do. If we would just all cooperate. You do not deserve my cooperation. Finally! Thank God. But after all I've done to cheer you up. Oh, I'm sorry. After what you have done? Either way, try harder. But I'm sure you'd die trying. You haven't even taken a sip of my coffee yet. That'd sure, surely calm down your nerves, miss. Mister, you're dodging the real issue here. You're just wasting my time. I told you. You were literally ta uh, talking. Taking! Up half the width of the hallway. Even worse, right in the middle. And you were running. Read the handbook section 7.4. I'm surprised a novice like me knows more. And a supposed veteran. Whoa. Look who's gung-ho about transferring. 
She knows the handbook like the back of her hand. Why, thank you. That's what the... <laughs> that's what the back of my hand is for. The front is for, you know. Dealing with you, just in case. If you didn't know, nor normal people do their business at the side. And make way for others. But I guess some people simply aren't part of that population. Sir... Have you ever heard the speed limits? I think someone here could take that page from traffic etiquette. Getting this show on the road, huh? Well... Ever heard of middle lane hogging? Go ahead. Take a page. Oh my. Get this show on the road? Did you just use an idiom literally? How cheesy. Actually, that was a double entrod. I used the idiom both literally as intended. Too bad my ingenuity went for over your head. I wish ingenuity were as at an What the Bob too stupid and the name for genius right now. Running out of fuel? Cause that was lame. Admit it. Your car has crashed. Is it my fault your car crashed into mine? Flat tire. Huh? What's that even supposed to mean? I said, you're a flat tire. What? Oh, you monster. You really want to get it, do you? I'd be. Flat turd. <laughs> You dirty sicko! Oh. Hmm. I'm gonna just take a sip of my drink. Uh. I'll talk to you later. Good afternoon, uh, Miss Chavez. Good day, Mrs. Chavez. Looking fancy today. How are we doing? Of course, it's you again. Although, it's the first time you brought someone with you. I, I sincerely apologize for the trouble. I hope we can resolve this ASAP. Whatever. I'm in a hurry. Come on, follow me. Oh, she's a... You know what, never mind. Okay, let's begin. Mrs. Legaspi has, every, has told me everything. I have to say, what you've committed is one serious offense. Uh, serious indeed. But it's his fault! Hold your horses, miss. You'll get a chance to speak up later. Understood. I'm sorry. Flat tire. Come again? Your sedan. Think it as a flat tire. How do you know? I just saw it earlier. And? There it was. A flat tire. So flat you wouldn't even be able to drive it. That sounds horrible. I have to get that fixed. Absolutely. That's it. Miss. Where are your manners? It's his fault. All his. He was blazing through the hallway without a care in the world. Mr. No running in the... No running in the halls. We made that clear in the handbook, didn't we? You guys did make it clear. Props to you for that. Four thumbs up. But little Missy here was blocking the middle of the hallway. Oh, miss. I'm sorry, but you can't do that. You should have known to give way, right? <laughs> no, but look. Isn't it clear who should be held accountable? Clear as day. If you weren't running in the first place, none of this would have happened. Same outcome if she weren't blocking the hallway. Plus, you wouldn't have to have annoyed a bunch of school your schoolmates. Pretty sure you annoyed a bunch of them along the way, too. But you just don't want to admit it. Silence! I've had enough of you two. I'm calling your parents now. No, please. I just transferred here. They'd be so... No. Please don't. Don't look at me like that, Mark. You surprise me. Mark? Well then, 
If you don't want me to call your parents for the love of everything good and holy, just make up with each other. What? How? Figure it out or I'll call your parents now. I've got a mall white sail to catch, so make it quick. Hmm. Okay, fine. I'll cover everything. I'll pay for the repainting of the walls and flooring. That's good. I'll get you a cool gift too. Because I love the school and I love you. No, you don't have to, but okay. And lastly... I'll help little Missy here redo her art poster. Which I obliterated to bits. That sounds like a good plan then. It covers everything we'd otherwise worry about. My pleasure. But Mark, I've been hearing about your grades. Remember, you can't make up for that in any way. You have to study harder. If you want to stay here. Yeah, I will. I'm gonna miss you guys if I leave. So miss, how does Mark's plan sound to you? Uh... I can take it, I guess. Alright. You two may go home now. Wait, what about schoolwork due today? <laughs> Turn them in next week. Your teachers will understand. Awesome! More time to do that stupid art project. Er, uh, I guess. Okay, this is my final warning. Mark, please don't run in the halls. Miss, please don't block them. Do you two understand? Understood, Miss Chavez. It won't happen again. Yeppers. Yummers. Meeting adjourned. Be safe on the way home. So. Oh, wow. Well, uh, that happened. You got away with it just like that? Just like that. Cool, eh? For the record. Since you still ruined my first day. I'm totally not forgiving you. Cool. Not yet, that is. I never bothered to ask your name. So what is it? As much as I hate to introduce myself to you. I'm Nicole Laksamana. Uh. Uh, you can call me Nicole. Hey, seriously though, sorry. Obviously, neither of us wanted to crash into each other. Uh-huh. So what are you gonna do? Two hours later. I could have used a little help back there. You carried all of that, Mark? For me? Aw. You forced me to. Oh, you're such a gentleman. Not a lot of gentlemen these days, you know. Why'd you even shop this much? I thought we were just gonna buy art supplies. Like, do you really need a new toothbrush holder? Uh-huh. We buy one every week. The house ghost keeps stealing it. And all these plastic hooks and clothespins. Why, yes. I collect cl clothespins as a hobby. There's a subjetted subreddit. There's a subreddit for that. And all these skirts and shirts. Really? Have you been wearing the same set of clothes every day? Ew, absolutely not. I'm not as filthy as you. And seriously, a knife set? I'm gonna need more than one knife if you misbehave. Let's just get it over with. What's taking you so long to open that door? You're nagging. Welcome to our humble abode. Our new humble abode. So that's why. We just moved in a few days ago. Still needs work, I know. Uh, is no one else home? Ha, you wish. My parents are sleeping in the back. You better keep it down. And your siblings? Well, I wish I had one. It's a hassle-free life, I'd say. No trouble, no drama. 
No petty arguing. Where's the fun in that? Hey, I'm gonna get changed. Stay right there and don't touch anything. Don't do touch everything. Got it. Hey. Can I use the bathroom? Whatever happened to keeping it down? I was just asking. This is a nice place. Oh, wow. Nerds will be like the center of ass or whatever. But really, this is magic to my eyes. It's cool. Hmm. Wait. Who's that in the picture? Wait. Who is that in that picture? Of course, the staple of every home. Good old pirated DVDs. <laughs> Micro mind? In I see Interstellar. Let's see what flicks they've got. Micro mind. A dumb supervillain inadvertently defeats his enemies with his inherently deplorable IQ. Rat tat. Ram a professional rat chef. Oh my fucking god. He gives up his culinary ways and commits to a savage gangster life of robbery and gang wars. Sardian. Sardian Benny. Gay soldier fights terrorists with a fart gun. But people are going to watch this movie anyway. Boom boom pack. What the fuck? The final amazing pow. Starring 36 local artists all mashed into one star studded film. That's it. I don't ask about the plot. There's none. Damn it pops my eyes. <laughs> they never keep their point stash somewhere safe do they? Wait. Are you not going to look at the picture, bro? I'm afraid we didn't hire a housemaid. <laughs> hey! Oh my. Do we have a scaredy cat here? Don't tell me you wouldn't jump too. Someone just appeared out of thin air. I would, but... Your face would just make me burst out laughing. Anyway, we're painting here, right? Of course. You think we're doing this in my room? Don't get any funny ideas. Oh, I'm not that low. The only funny idea I'm having is painting circles on your face. Oh well, we're going in circles. Let's just start, shall we? I kind of want to put the knife set beside me. You know, for self-defense. Do you mind? If I can have half of the knives to pr protect myself as well, then not at all. Good. Let's begin then. How about you go first? That's inefficient, don't you think? How about we just paint together? I want to see your potential. Impress me. Heck, maybe you'd even inspire me. All I'm hearing is... I want to boss you around coated in sugar. Haha, <laughs> no really. Let's see what you've got. Um, sure. Guess I'll go first. Picasso in the works. Oh! Oh! Pew! Oh, fuck my dumbass. Pew! Um, oh, I have to finish the line, bruh. Pew! 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 Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? Painting? In black? What's wrong about that? The theme is Mother Earth. I know. Climate change, environment, or whatever. So why does it look like you're painting nonsense? Hey, watch your words. This is avant-garde and it's peak. And if you know our teacher well, she gets off on weird art. Exploiting her pretentious taste with pretentiousness. Hmm, I see. I had that ep epiphany back when I was running my ass off in the halls. Never thought you'd ask. 
Th thought to ask, why were you running in the first place? I had about seven minutes to cram this shit. I rushed to the store, but there you were. Majestically blocking the way. Say what? Seven minutes? That shouldn't come off as a surprise for me. Oh, that's right. We just met. It wasn't your first time at the principal's office, was it? Oh, it was. I just happened to flawlessly operate the coffee maker by accident. Lucky me. Crazy. You weren't fearing for your life one bit. Yep, I was scared to death. Mrs. Chavez's makeup was truly haunting. Hey, let me at least add some blue. Bow. Bow. Get, give me green. Can I get green? Can I get green? Can't get green, guys. I guess I'm painting in blue. I... I don't get it. Ah, yes. A brilliant representation of oil spills destroying our lovely oceans. I can already see Flores' eyes sparkling. Hold on. I don't get it. Why do you live like this? Why? Shut up. I need to concentrate. I'm channeling my inner Pollock. I mean, are there even any upsides? Ask our classmate Kyle. He crams way more than I do. He's a true expert. You know what? I suggest that... Could definitely use more effort. I suggest not spending my precious effort on this. Could also use more color. You know what I mean? I have no time for your color theory bullcrap. You don't need to know color theory. You just have to, you know, let it shine. We didn't buy a glossy paint. I mean, are you seriously okay with this? Settling for this Pollock ripoff? Look, all I need to do is get the job done. With the least possible effort. But do you even find enjoyment in it? Of course not. Not that it matters, right? Hey, watch, I'll show you how it's done, <gasps> Picasso, oh great, someone's doing the dirty work for me, thank you so much, hey look at me, fine fine, we can still turn this pitiful artwork to a lively one, just wait and see, hooray, I think it needs more color, okay, dash of white, a splash of red, a drop of blue. Hollow purple. Ding! Do you see it? It's coming together now. Whoa. It's much better now, right? I don't like saying this, but... To your face, but... It is. You see, Mark? I just enjoy the things I do. And whenever I find that enjoyment... Everything else naturally shines. She's probably right. Everything shines. You just have to find that spark. You're crazy. I like to think I am. Oh. What the? What? what? Oh no. Getting there. What the hell happened? Uh, are you done? Just a little bit more. Hey, that's enough. You've already helped. And done. <laughs> so, what do you think? Why long face now? Don't get me wrong. It's nice and all, but... I really wanted to illustrate climate change. That sounds kind of bleak, doesn't it? I don't know. I guess it's realistic down and down to earth. Really? Hey, that's mine. 
Plus, my work shouldn't look that good. Flores knows that. And just switch it up. She won't catch it. Even if I do, it doesn't feel like it's mine. Sprinkle your personal finesse then. At your own touch. That's not gonna work. Wait a minute. I know what's what it's missing. There's nothing missing. I'll make the stars bigger. Maybe even cuter. Go ahead. It's yours after all. To be clear, this is yours and that is mine. Just give me a moment to perfect this. Better now. Look. Awesome. It deserves to be yours. No, you deserve this. Hold on, I'll give you more stars. Can I have blue? Can I, can I have green? Blue? I cannot have... Ooh, fuck. Oh shit, I lost my mouse. Oh, there you go. Whoa! Here, it... it You're right. This is mine. Don't mention it. And don't worry. I won't need half of the knives. <laughs> I wish I could stab you. That'd be an honor. I wonder. What's living here like? Brace yourself. Everything's unique here at, Lot at Liamson. They've got exotic tentacles for Christmas. And wrestle me... Wrestling mechas for New Year's. Quite a culture shocker. I wish that were the case, but I was asking nicely. Same old, same old. You're st still in the dreary heart of the capital. Do you have its siblings? We're both only children. And you think it's hassle-free? Did I stutter? And your parents? What do they do for a living? Unlike yours, neither of them are talk show hosts. What if I told you I want to be one someday? And drown people in your hollow questions? Good luck. So what do they do for a living? Since you won't shut up. What if I told you I live all alone? What? It's true. Both of them work abroad. Pays good. Well, too good. They don't want to stop working. What do you mean? That's sick. Pollock, look at this. You must be so proud of me right now. I get that they're both overseas workers, but what do they do? Oh boy, would you look at that? The sun's sitting. Guess I should be going now. Is your dad like an engineer or something? He repairs giant wrestling mechas, you annoying talk show host. Hey, where's the bathroom? Sadly, your wrestling mecha ripped it apart yesterday. You have to pee outside. I'll try my luck then. Try not getting sucked in, snub. Is it the first door? Did I guess right? I did. What is in this room? Is it her room? Oh my god. Whoa! Does anyone in her family play? Can I play? Chrysler. Nicole. Oh my god. She does. Can't believe it. She plays. Are these trophies? Well, those trophies are hers. Let me, let me play. Let me play. Let me play. She's a pianist? Oh boy, since when? Excuse me. What are you doing here? I didn't know you could play. Shut up and get out of here. No. <laughs> you see, I've been trying my best at this. But it's, it just isn't working. Maybe you could be my mentor. Who knows? We might make a great team. I'm not even kidding. 
I do not care and I'm not kidding either. Get the hell out of here now. Oh shit, did I just strike a nerve? But hey, no ifs, no buts. Just get out. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have. Get out of this house at once. It's when I thought you were a decent guy. You were trespassing personal spaces. Who told you you could just go anywhere you like? I... I'm sorry. You know what? I don't want anything to do with you. Please, just go ahead and leave. But... I said, go ahead and leave. Honey, you woke us up. What's going on here? Nothing, Mom. It was just a... A rat, a big one. I had to shoo that nasty critter away. Hi, Mrs. Duck. Some mana. Damn, I'm sorry for the burp. How was your first day at school? It must have been wonderful. Seeing that you already got yourselves a friend here. Well, uh... He's not my friend. It's a bit complicated, actually. He's more like a... Transferee advisor of sorts. Transferee advisor? Never heard of that before. Is that a thing now? Apparently. They usually wear a shiny badge. It seems like he forgot to put it on. What? Ahem. Isn't that correct, Mr. Advisor? Oh, uh, she's right, Mrs. Luxamana. I'm a student rep who guides new students. Glad to meet you. See, told you. Not a friend. <laughs> I don't see the difference, honey. I can't see why the two of you won't be good friends. Uh, I guess. I think so too. See, hon? And he's a looker too. Uh, anyway. My advisor's gotta go home. Right, Mr. Noble Advisor? Yeah, I just came here to, uh, help her with the project and give her some epic school tips. What? Oh, sorry. Are you in a hurry, dear? Strict parents. Yeah. He's so in a hurry. He told me he has to... I don't think so. Not much to do back at home, really. Great. Say, would you care to join us for dinner? Yeah! I'll cook Nicole's favorite pork sigig. Sisig? Sisig? I don't know what the fuck you call it, man. Please, don't cook me in the comments. I'll bet you'll love it. Um. Oh dear, where are my manners? What's your name? His name's Mark. Just so you know, he has a pork alley. So Mark, care to join us for dinner? Uh. Sure. Why not? I love sausage. <laughs> All right. Sorry for the mess, Mark. You've just moved in, but please make yourself at home. Thank you, Mom. Uh, I mean, Mrs. Luxemana. Sorry. You could say I'm your mother for the night. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm taking a sip. Damn. Almost died. Great. I'll be in the kitchen if anyone needs me. Oh, the tables have turned. Honey, would you please make our guests feel comfortable? Ha, you bet. I sure will. Thanks, hon. Hey, sis. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so fun. Man. Oh, this is something. This is something. This is really something. Ha 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 Ha! Oh! <laughs> oh! I don't know why I'm doing sound effects. I should stop. Mm. What the heck?
Bye. And I wanted to hear the conversation, bro. Oh no. I don't wanna fucking read this chat again. Offline. Abra, what's up? Oh, ho, oh, hey Nicole, what's up? I was just stay at the principal's dungeon. You know, nothing new. Should get that off of my fucking. Except for the fact I was with that troublesome girl. Troublesome? Yeah, because you started trouble, airhead. She kind of gets under my skin, too. Hmm. So, what she's like? What she like? Man, I'm dumb! You think she belongs with me? Not a chance. She attacks with sharp words, too. Keep out unless you want your dignity robbed. Oh no, not again. But since you've already made the first move anyways, go ahead. I don't care now. As if you can even call it a move. Think about it, man. You crash into her so bad. Do you have any inkling of what that means? Newton's third law? No, you sham nerd. There was a love cupid at work locking your destinies into place. The moment you ran into her, boom, your heart's magically intertwined. Wow, that's cool. I know, right? My boy's finally gonna get some experience to joys of long young love. Young love, my ass. She was still mad at me the moment I left. What? What do you mean you left? From where? We did our art project at little Missy's home. We gotta get get our typing session in, guys. Oh my god. Did you just get a girlfriend and climb up the ladder all in one day? <laughs> I don't know what you mean by the climbing up the ladder, but nah. Like hell we'd get along. Damn it. I was just about to have your congratulatory poster printed. Oh, I guess I'll have to wait some more. What? This should have been a surprise, but uh, who cares? Oh my god, what is that? Congratulations, Mark, for embarking a new journey in your pub <laughs> pubescent love life. <laughs> oh no! What the? I just look like I died. Who the heck did this? Yours truly. You sure have lots of time on your hands, huh? What's the fun in having lots of time if I can't spend it with Kate? Ugh, she could have been the one. Is it because... I'm a flat tire? I doubt it. It's not like you're boring, right? Uh... What? What? Oh man. You really think that's what it means? But uh, yeah, it's like a blind person. What does it mean? Oh. Are you... Right? Oh no. Uh, it actually means... Forget it. Gotta sleep now. Uh, okay. I already knew what it mean the first time he said it. 
Like, come on. She looked down. Hey. Yeah? Please don't tell me you called her that. <laughs> that would be such a funny response. Kind of surprised you started the convo this time. Weird saying that, lol. Anyway. Don't you dare forget about our trip, okay? What trip? Alright, the one I've been pushing you and Riddle for. Oh, right. The trip at the fair. Pff, yeah, you airhead. So, just so we can have more fun before, you know, before Riddle leaves for shooting. What happens if I don't go? I will murder you. Not asking for your confirmation. I'm coercing you, my slow, my lowly subordinate. Okay, okay, I'll go. Good, good boy. See you then. Good night. Oh, oh, it's Luis. Never mind. What's up? Hey, I'm sorry for that ruckus back there. Uh, that's not my concern. But if you... Uh, but I know you can do better. You deserve adequate sleep as well. Yeah, sorry. Anyway, Miss Flores asked me to inform you that you may submit your work on Monday. Yep, Mrs. Chavez also told me that. Thanks. Also, Sophia told me she wants to come over with me at the hospital. Only if you're free, of course. Are we visiting her grandma? Yes. I'm certain she mostly wants a new company. She must be getting sick of mine. I doubt that, haha, <laughs> but sure. I'd be happy to come over. Alright then. She'd be glad to see you there, too. Hey, uh, Luis? Yes? Any new findings on the, you know? I do. And actually, I was hoping we'd talk about it privates when, once we meet. Gotcha. I'll come over then. Okay, then. See you. Sleepy time. Oh, sorry. I had my mouse on the screen this entire time, bro. I'm sorry. It's Friday night for crying out loud. Stupid phone games aren't cutting it. What should I do? Drink water. I said drink water, bro. Drink some water. It's good for you. I'm drinking a monster, so I should not be talking. Good idea. Before those tiny little worms take over again. I'll take out the trash, that's good too. Drink some water? No, I guess... We're going in here, maybe some TV or some... That sent me this a year after I started. St they started working a. Jesus, he joked they finally come home once I finish this. You haven't finished it since. Well, I don't think he was kidding. Oh my god, I don't want to read this, bro. Oh no. Oh. What do I do with this? What do you want me to do with this? Back them? There you go. What do you want me to do with this? Um.
don't know where to take this, bro. Am I dumb? Oh, I clicked off the screen. Am I dumb? Oh, fuck. Gotta head out and pay these tomorrow. Very exciting. I'm dumb, bro. I could have just... Yeah, watch TV. Sure, why not? Let's watch local TV just like everyone else on the internet. It totally does. But see what's on TV. TV channel 3. Almost midnight indeed. Coming up tomorrow on the two mistresses and possibly one more as a cheap plot twist. No merits. He's mine. He's always been mine. How damn, I almost died. How dare you? You only love him because he's wa he's a walking money bag. You want war? I'll give you war. Okay, show. Welcome to your favorite late night show. Tonight starring Boy Profusio. As you may have heard, today is a very special day. Known as the rising star from Sayurgo... Sayurgo? Paolo Kuripot. Thank you so much for having me here, Boy Profuso. We're glad to have you here, Paolo. So tell me, Paolo. And you know this. Whoa. And you know this is what the audience wants to finally hear. What do your parents do for a living? Get lost. Hey, come back here. What? Where do you go? I don't know, sir. Damn it, we lost him. This is also... Auto Broadcasting Network Channel 7. Now, signing off. I don't think I'll resort to TV ever again. Better try something else. Movie? PlayStation! PlayStation! PlayStation 3! Our gaming. What do we have here? Please tell me I can actually game, bro. It's a bunch of games on sale I impulsively bought, but never bothered to touch. Oh! <gasps> Yahoo! 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 Chop! Boink! Chop! Boink! Chop! I want to get that chest up there. Into the trash folder, you that was it, bro. Man, I was enjoying my game, man. Ooh, this one's look cute. Oh, fuck off. No, 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 Welcome to the club! It's nice meeting you, I love sucking lemons! Seriously? You brought, you brought a boy? Way to kill the atmosphere. Ah, you must be I love su sucking lemons. What a nice surprise. Welcome to Kokoro Literature Club. There are no words. There are no words. This club is full of incredibly cute girls. This seems fun, I can take this. If I had to choose, I'd probably date Aerie. Oh no! Oh no! Oh shit! He gently opened the door. My god, that's it, I'm out of here. Guys, if you know those voices I did for the characters, uh, yeah, you're, you're a legend if you know those. Oh, let's go! No, I wanna pick, bro. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about, baby. I'm just gonna win a couple of matches and I'm I now level up again. That'll get me going for sure. I wanna pick my character. Can I watch the gameplay at least? Level 46. Yeah. I'm bored now. Watch him be like, I'm bored now. What was he playing even? I don't know. Forget it. Maybe talking to random strangers will work. How is his hair moving like that? I want magic. 
Hello, ASL. Am I dumb? I don't know what it means. What? <laughs> See? He even doesn't know. Age, sex, location. What? 15M redacted. Dumbass. Are you for real, you fucking diddy, bro? What the? Yeah, I told you, diddy. Hey, yo. Uh, hey. 15M. Bellica. Low. Are you fucking for real, bro? Fucking diddies. Oh, I get it. Fact that you're an M, bro. Watch. He's gonna say 15F. See? 20F. Do I wanna... Ah, let's get some content, guys. 20F Bellica. Watch. Hey there. Diddy. Fuck. Hey there, babe. Oh, no, I can't. What you doing? <sighs> bored. Alone at home. Oh, nothing. I'm just bored alone at home. I could use a little help. Sh I'm not. What can I help you with? Well, I'm, s I'm a simple woman with simple desires. <laughs> Yay! I'm whispering it in your ear. <laughs> Can you feel me beside you? You want me, you want to know what I desire? V Bucks. Your card number, expiry date. And the three numbers on the back. <laughs> Joker needs your help. <laughs> Fuck, bitch. Not today, man. Not today. That was kind of good content, though. Frank and a fucking ditty. Hey there. Uh, aren't you gonna ask ASL? What's that? It doesn't matter. I shouldn't. It shouldn't. Why does it matter to you? No, no, it's my first time here, and I just seem like the norm. It just seems like the norm, I'm dumb. Or the horny guys, yes, it's the norm. Figures. But I just want a genuine talk with a real person, yeah? Sure, I'm up for that. Got nothing else to do anyways. Awesome. You mind listening to my monologue? It won't be long. Well, probably. Just want to vent about my feelings out there. No, no, no. At all, go ahead. I feel like this is. I don't have much friends to talk to, even if I do talk to them. I I can't help but feel guilty draining them with my personal shit. That sucks. It's comforting to know random people can listen to my problems. And really, that's all you have to do, listen. I'm all ears. You see... I've always been dreaming of accomplishing this one thing in my life. A year ago, after preserving thought through it all, I did it. I finally did it. Sounds great. So, I thought that was it. I achieved my life goal. I thought I was going to be happy and complete, but after several months, I realized I was wrong. What happened? Call me crazy or whatever, but nothing happened. It was just time that kept pushing through, and I just woke up one day without any drive. Go on. It's weird. I don't know why. They told me I should be setting higher goals. But I just can't do it now that, you know. Sorry, I kind of don't understand. It's okay. Maybe there's really no understanding to be sought in feeling lost. 
Maybe I just happened to float in this futile, futile void. Maybe. So, now I'm stuck nowhere. And I don't know where to go. Say, have you ever felt like this? Honestly, I don't know. If not, then good for you. Don't take it for granted. It's okay if you didn't understand me. I'm just glad you listened. Have you tried finding a hobby? Yes, I have a long time ago. And then it became a job, lol. No, I mean a new one. I tried things here and there, but... Some, something invisible keeps, me sto uh, keeps stopping me from enjoying anything. Have you tried therapy? I wasn't even kidding. ASL 19F Uranus. Ooh, my answer. I can't. I give up. Do you like the Smiths? The Smiths, what? Yo! Motherfucker. Smiths, that's... Hold on. Am I thinking of the right... Hold on. Give me a second. Am I thinking of the right... Yep, I am. Motherfucker, I love the Smiths. Two lover and twine pass me by And heaven knows I'm miserable now that's it. I give up. People are boring. You are boring for not knowing the Smiths. What is this envelope doing here? Oh, whoa. I remember now. Riddle got an instant camera as a birthday gift. It became our little toy at the mall for a day. He didn't like it at first, but look where, he, where he's at now. Oh my god. Cotton candy. Gambling. Oh my fucking god, more gambling. Tickets. Running. Security. Ticket scarves? Until then, love Kath. How did this thing even get here? My 13th, uh, come on. You know I don't listen to normie music. Okay, bro. Looks like I've tried everything. Nothing catches my attention today for some reason. Not even games, for God's sakes. I have no idea. Whatever, I should just sleep this off. Right, I love the sheet music here. Hmm. I wish I could read these and understand every detail like mom does. Actually, no, you know what? A little practice might get me going. Yes, more piano. Let's go. I love piano, man. It's sing me a song. Do, 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 do. Still won't work. Hold on, sorry. Damn. Damn. Still won't work. Negative. Have you tried turning it off and on? Oh, it was just muted. I had dumb dumb. Where'd you get that from anyway? 
I never knew you had a piano, let alone interest in music. No. This is my mom's. Oh, that's cool. Does she play? As a hobby, yeah, she used to. She'd always do classical uh, when I was a kid. What happened? Why'd she stop? It just got too busy, I guess. Maybe that's why I want to give it a shot. Give it a shot? Do you even know how to play anything? No. But maybe one day. That's not how it goes. Try to remember, Mark, please. She's such a talented, lovely kid. She? You like it? I don't like it, Mom. I love it. I wish I could see her again. See who? Mark, is this a good time to talk? Anytime's a good time to talk. This won't be easy for me to say, but... You see, her, she's such a talented kid. Hold on, that picture, bro, still in her house. I don't know. Like turning my head against this shit. Wish I could listen to a song for the first time again. I wish I could watch a film for the first time again. I wish I could live a moment for the first time again. It's like I felt everything there is to feel. like there's nothing else to wait for but maybe Just maybe.
I can feel alive again. Please don't end the chapter, bro. Please don't end. No! No! Oh. Man! I want the chapter to end. The game is so good, bro. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Oh, I, I love this game, bro. Ah, well. The day feels weird. Fuck. Sorry. I just... Shit has me invested every time and then it just... Fucks me over, man. Chapter 3. Shit. Ah, well, guys. That was until then. Chapter 2. I will have this part up. Uh, I think on a Sunday. For me. I think. Knowing how my schedule goes. It might be a Saturday, actually. Just, just, just a weekend, because I'm busy. I'm honestly really busy. <laughs> you might not believe me when I say this, but I am busy with work and shit. So it's just... <sighs> well, guys, that, that honestly, that had me invested, and it, I don't know. Kind of felt like my voice was cracking for a bit at the end. I don't know why, but it just was. This game is honestly really good so far. And we're only at chapter three right now. It's really good. Well, anyways, guys, that was chapter two. I'll have it up by Sunday. I might... If I have time tomorrow, record uh, chapter three already and maybe have it up. Maybe just I'm, I'm saying maybe guys, I don't know. It's exporting uh, or like getting the video done takes me like two and a half hours to run through my editing system because I don't know why, but it just it just kind of broke, I guess. And, uh, oh, that isn't too much, actually. It takes, like, another 30 minutes to actually, like, export it, I guess. Like, the, the time thing. I don't know how to explain it. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. But, yeah, I might re record another one later. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, subscribe, all that. Just if you enjoyed this part, please do. Uh, I'm trying to make a comeback. Trying. I'm just busy. But anyways, drink some water. Go sleep. Do whatever you want. Eat. Stay healthy and stuff. Well, see you guys later. Good night, suckers.